Hello YouTube viewers, Sweet Tips here. And uh, Mrs. Sweet Tips has issued a directive. She wants the gold dropped out of those solutions this evening. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make a video right now about uh, getting the pure gold out of the electrolyte solutions that we used for the electrolytic gold refining cell. And we're gonna do that right now. All right, here's our three solutions. This is the uh, cell that we use to make the electrolytic gold. Here's a little 14K wire with a little bit of uh, pure gold left on it. I'll set that aside and we'll refine that later in a different batch. I'll pour this through a filter over here. This is the rinse water that we used to rinse the uh, electrolytic gold piece that we refined off. And if you look down there, it looks like we got some metallic gold crystals. I think those are metallic gold that precipitated out of the uh, highly concentrated electrolyte solution. We'll set that off to the side. And then uh, here's our highly concentrated electrolyte solution. It's got some pieces of uh, gold floating on top of it there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to set this out of the way and I'm going to pull up our filter flask here and get this thing set up to filter these solutions and then we'll just uh, add some sodium metal bisulfite and drop the gold out of all three of those beakers. Alright, we'll start with the electrolyte out of the cell. Let me get the magnet out of there first. filter and we're pulling a vacuum over there so I'm going to pour our solution in now and filter this out so we can uh, drop it drop the pure gold out with sodium metal bisulfite here we go we'll do the uh, this is the rinse water that we used to rinse to the, uh, the pure gold crystal that we grew in the electrolytic cell off with. It's just got some gold in it, still water. We'll add that to our uh, concoction here. This is our uh, contents of our filter. There's the little piece that's left over from the anode bar. And then here's some pieces of uh, gold crystal I believe that came out of solution in the concentrated chloroauric acid electrolyte solution alright here we go with the rest of the electrolyte pour this through the filter and filter out any solids in here this is our highly concentrated solution it's got a third of a gram per ml of fluid in this highly concentrated solution here that we're pouring into the funnel right now. If you look in the beaker here, you'll see I've got some uh, solids down in the bottom there. This was the highly concentrated electrolyte solution. I think those are possibly chloral auric acid crystals that have come out of solution and uh, coated the inside of the beaker there. down here in our flask and what we'll do now I'm gonna take this funnel here we're gonna rinse the color out of it I'm gonna take that filter paper as I get it rinsed out we're gonna add the filter paper to our beaker over here it's got the uh, gold crystals in it and we'll dissolve everything in aqua regia we'll take that out separately we'll do that 
uh, at a different time, not right now. I just want to get the uh, gold precipitated out of our electrolyte solution down here. Nice and clear, this is going to be high purity gold. Looking good. This looks like metallic gold to me. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get that filter into this beaker now. Now what we'll do is uh, dissolve this gold separately. And give it a separate refining. Set our beaker that's still got some solids in it. The filter and some pieces of gold in there. Up here on the heat. Add a little bit of hydrochloric acid. About 50, 75 milliliters here. And then we'll turn some heat on. And start dissolving that little bit of gold in there. That's Concentrated nitric here, 68 percent. Concentrated nitric acid. I'll add a couple of uh, milliliters to our uh, container here. We'll go ahead and get this remaining gold dissolved. Now I'm just rinsing with uh, 
distilled water here. Once you can get it rinsed off, the uh, gold settles out quickly. And we'll pour this off, and then we're going to get this into a crucible and uh, melt it up. And pour it some water and make some shot. All right, here's our pure gold pieces. What we're gonna do is slowly pour them into a container here, get the water out of there. Rinse it out of there with some fresh hot tap water here. more gold left in there. It's all down here in our uh, pan. Pour off this water and we'll take it out on the heat and dry it off. These are pure gold. Beautiful. been dried off real good. I'm going to get a weight on it now. We've got, let's see what we got here. Let's 
Looks like we got 154.5 grams. That would be almost five troy ounces of pure gold. Well, this one went by fairly smooth. I got all the gold out of the electrolytic refining cell solutions. I've got it all precipitated out. And uh, we've got it here in uh, small pieces so we can divide it up however we need to. And uh, there's just under five troy ounces of pure gold here. And uh, you know what? That'll conclude the video. Thanks for watching.